welcome to this channel once again thanks so much for clicking on this video so if you're new here please hit on the subscribe button to subscribe if you're old here thanks so much for coming back again so today we're going to look at how to download and install different fonts in photoshop now when it comes to photoshop like this we have the default fonts that comes when you install photoshop and this one for example acrobat is not one of them so in order to use such fonts bold stylish ones you need to download them so today we're going to look at how to get them how to install them and then how to make use of them in photoshop apparently this is going to also apply to your word documents and add a couple of stuffs on your machine so if you want to use it that would be cool with you so first off i'm using google chrome for this it works in opera mini and then add a couple of browsers so the first step that i will show you is when you know the name of the font for example i'll be making use of massive display font over here this font is one that i just got to know about so if you know the name of the font all that you need to do is you come to your search box and then you type in your font name so that is it and then when it opens it is going to give you different websites that you can download it from so all that you need to do is to click on any of them my favorite one of all my favorite website that i download free fonts is the font.com it is absolutely free and sometimes all that you need to do is to give some credit to the owner of the author okay so when the website opens all you have to do is to come to download over here so we have download over here and then you click download so you wait for it to download for you so basically when it finished downloading it is going to open it in the zip for me i have zip installed on my computer so if you don't have zip and then you're having something like power iso it is going to also open so i've made my download location to my desktop to make this easier so when it is done open i come to my zip file and then i open it okay so basically let me just show you this first when i come to photoshop and then i try to type in the massac font the font that i just downloaded when i go to my font over here and i try to type in massac there is nothing over there because i haven't installed that okay so we're going to be back in photoshop and try this after we've installed it okay so the zip has been open for us you double click on it again and then you wait for it to open like this so this is the font that we are about installing so it gives you the preview of it so you go to install and then you wait for it to install okay so that is it we are done installing our font so let's go back to photoshop and then here we're going to pick our test tool try to select all this and go to our font family and then we start to type massac so this time around since we installed it when you hit enter that is the font that we just installed so basically that is it that is the first step if you know the name of the font you want to download and install now what if you don't know anything about the name of the font that you want to install probably you want to try out different fonts like you want to test out different fonts that one is very easy all you need to do is you come to google and then you can google free uh let's say free fonts download free fonts downloads okay so when you select it it is going to give you a couple of free font sites that you can download and one of them is 101 1001 freefonts.com the font.com fontsquare.com i'm going to list a lot of them in the description so you can check out if you want to get a free website to download free fonts you don't have to pay for it sometimes all you have to do is to give credit to the authors so that is it so let's try out something like 101 free fonts download.com if you click on it it comes with a couple of free fonts when you scroll down over here 
we have so many free phones and that is it so anyone you want to download you just click on the download button over here and then it downloads for you and then you follow the procedure we just followed to install the font and then you can use it in your photoshop or your microsoft word or any other thing that requires a font on your computer so basically that's it check in the description box for a lot of free websites that you can download so many fonts for free like this video if you like it and don't forget to share because it might help somebody else thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like and subscribe and then i'll get back to you with another video so it's innocent here